three straight. They're going to the Super Bowl. 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 Okay. The Patriots versus the Rams. My God. First off, let me get off with the Chiefs. A lot of people are probably going to disagree, but or is going to disagree with this, but the Chiefs do need to fire their defensive coordinator. That's no if, answer, buts. Ranked number 30, 31 in the NFL, and it, oh, and it showed tonight. Tom Brady was running through that D. Also, Patrick Mahomes. Patrick Mahomes had a hell of a season. I'm not going to deny that. Hell of a season. He brought them back. But, of course, that Kansas City defense. That's how Tom Brady literally got to y'all defense. Like this toothpick there. Also... Let me say this, too. And I know that some people are going to dislike this one. For the Patriots. Do people say everybody, everyone in this whole entire world, except for the people in Boston, Mass., don't want to see this team in the Super Bowl? No one don't want to see this team in the Super Bowl. I don't want to see them in the Super Bowl. They are the most hateable organization. Probably in NFL history. Everyone is, <laughs> my God, this, I don't know, like I said, like I, first off, shout outs to Spotlight, Spot, Spotlight Sports Talk, hopefully I got that name right, I'm sorry, because I'm so pissed off right now, the A, this proves to me that the AFC is nothing but a joke, what is the point of having the number one seed if you were Kansas City, what was the point of, of all the free agency moves. What is all the point if Tom Brady and Bill Belichick could pull off bullshit and still make the damn Super Bowl? They have, they suck when they're on the goddamn road. And they, once again, proved us all wrong, made us feel like idiots, and we, and now once again, to the Super Bowl. But also for Kansas City, this also screwed them too. Not only their defense, but that offside, that offside, the guy who was offsides, that really Screw them. If he wasn't offsides, that pick would have happened. End the game. Boop, whoop, whoop de doo Kansas City would be in the Super Bowl as we speak. And another call that was so, once again, ref ball, like I said, really? Roughing the passer? How the fuck was that roughing the passer? And that was another thing for this whole NFL season. The referees are very, were very, very fucking incompetent what the hell is pass interference what the hell is a catch to we went from what the hell is a catch what the hell is a tackle today what the hell is pass interference what now today what the hell is rough in the pass? what the hell is holding what the hell do these referees don't know what holding is what pass interference is what um Roughing the passer is that they not know anything? No, it seems like they don't. They literally damn near every, almost every single freaking game. There's always been some bullshit officiating that damn near causes a team big. Big. Please let me know in the comments on if you think I'm just a just freaking out here because all oh, the Patriots won. It's not just because of that. But the referees were incompetent. Also, the defense, the Kansas City defense couldn't even stop a damn, a damn running refrigerator. That was leaking. They couldn't even fix that. They, it, 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 it's sad. It, it's really sad. This is a dark day in the NFL. We're going to get the Patriots versus the Rams. Just think about that. The Patriots versus the Rams. The Saints got robbed, like I said in my last video. They were robbed. They were fucked. They got fucked. They were robbed. And as for the Rams is concerned, I'm going to get on them. They have a talented group. They really do. Only one little problem with the Rams. I 
hate their owner, Stan Kroenke. Biggest asshole in America, as far as I'm concerned. Next to a certain other individual. Um, so remember, like, the city of St. Louis offers him the moon and then some to keep the team in St. Louis. Yet this dude still screws them over and then goes to L.A.? Really? Oh, but it gets worse, you, you, say, you say. Remember, um, him, him uh, expanding his ranch in Texas, forcing homeowners to leave their own home? Hell, one man drove to suicide with it. Suicide! This is, this is, this is bad. This is really, wow. A team that didn't even deserve to go to the Super Bowl because of incompetent bullcrap officiating. And then another team that always finds a freaking way, even by deflating, that cheated to win one Super Bowl to um, make it constant Tom Brady. Also, coming back from 28, well, actually, that was due because the Atlanta Falcons were just they, they fell asleep. Let, let's be honest. They choked. And, but the only silver lining from it was the Eagles. The Eagles beat the freaking Patriots. But that didn't um, stand for much because, shoot, the Eagles fan base, that, that I'm not. Mm. But anyway, really? Three straight years in a row, the freaking Patriots? My God. People are tired of seeing this team. So I am begging. Begging teams who were in the AFC playoffs. Spend a little money. Do what you got to do. Dethrone the evil empire. Because that's what the, Patriot is, the Patriots are. We can hate all the Patriots all, all we want. But at the end of the day, they're still an organization that still wins championship. That still goes to the playoffs. And still makes it to the Super Bowl. Whoever wins this game, it's... It, we're screwed. We're all going to be pissed at the end. I know a lot of some people are going to probably pick the Rams. That's fine. If you're going to pick the Patriots, that's fine too. But at the end of the day, we're screwed. This is once a Super Bowl where there's two very two unlikable teams. One team that shouldn't be in it and another team, like I said earlier. For me, I don't like the Rams because of their owner. For what he did to not only for the, the city of St. Louis and for those people down there in Texas. Patriots, we all know the story. I can't stand Bill Belichick with the life of me. I hate that man to my core. Hate him. I'm still shocked that he's still a coach in the league for all the shady shit that he's done. But that's what we got. We got the Rams and the Patriots. So with that being said... Who you guys got for the Super Bowl? Do you have the do you are you gonna go with the a very talented squad but going for an owner who who's a very shallow heap of a man? Or do you go with an organization that cheated to win the Super Bowl that came back from what twenty was it was it twenty five points twenty eight points down from the Super Bowl and always finds a way to win? Let me know in the comment section below. Until next time, God bless you all. I'll see you next time.